A jaw harp, a juice harp, mouth harp, bargain, morcha, damoy. Many names, many cultures. And this is how to play it. I've been asked by a few people to do a tutorial. And there's loads of really good tutorials out there already, but here's my bit. So first things first, you need a jaw harp. These ones are played on your teeth, like so. This particular one is played with the lips. No teeth. No teeth. Yeah. Today we're going to be using teeth like this. Mouth open slightly, lips away from the teeth to start off with. Big smile. Hee. Enough for your little finger to just make a gap and keep it there, little gap, enough to be able to put your tongue through, just, mm -hmm. like that. Why? This reed has to be able to vibrate in and out of your mouth, and it needs to be able to do it unobstructed. So, teeth apart, big smile, Make whatever face you like. The jaw harp, these back pieces here, the frame, you want these parts to just sit on the tops of your teeth. You don't bite down, it's not this, it's this. Just on the tips of the teeth. The end that you will be plucking from, in my case, my right hand, the end of the jaw harp, I would say needs to be about a finger width away from the edge of your mouth. So you don't want it here. Because it'll catch your lip. You don't want it over here because you can't. Not ideal. About a finger width away from the side of your mouth. So here, here, teeth, here. See that little gap? Perfect. Finger, edge of your lip, jaw harp, big smile, on your teeth, gap in the middle for the reed to vibrate. And that's it. Start by plucking forward, start by plucking backwards, whatever feels good. I would pluck backwards. Might be that you pluck forwards. Whatever's easiest. How does it work? It's all about mouth shape. Ow. La 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 la. Chaka chaka. <sighs> Breathe in, mouth shape. Open and closing your throat. Open throat, closed throat. Open throat, closed throat. They sound different. So, start by saying vowel. A E I O U. When you pluck, A E I O U. Sounds like this. A E I O U. You don't vocalize the word, you just make the shape. Get it? Breathing out sounds different to breathing in. In. Out, in, out, in. Now different harps sound different. They have different saturation, they are lower, they are higher, they feel different. Some have very stiff reeds, like such. Some have softer reeds. 
and some are flat. Now, another exercise to do, la 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 la. Wiggle your tongue, to wiggle it up and down, different speeds. La 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 And if you can roll your tongue, cool. Sounds like this. You can mute the reed as well. So you can either do this with your finger. Stop the reed from moving. Or you can use your tongue. I use my tongue. Push it forward. To stop the reed from moving. And if you time it right, you can get the reed to slap your tongue. Sounds like. So you get a nice kick. Breathing in, breathing out, open and closing your throat. Different mouth shapes, muting, plucking different rhythms. Put it all together and you get something like this. Thank you for listening. Get harping.